and we're live. live in three, two, one. What's Ooh. up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another segment Shut of up, Suburb Sean. Talks. I'm your host, Nick Rajeda. <laughs> Joining me tonight, we have Sean Williams. Hello. Why do you think he's gay? I'm confused. Whoa, I just, dude. I don't know. I never Whoa, already, he was gay. already into the too but much. But he just said it. I felt like, didn't you guys think David Dobrik was a little bisexual? I yeah, listened so to his no podcast one. at work. No? no? No. I think he just did it for clout. You know, Carrie Martin. Woo! Yeah, well, anyways, Bailey told me. Luke he was hosts, bi. and Luke hosts is out. What up? Yeah. Woo! Anyways, guys, didn't thank, you, Austin. thank you for joining in on this <laughs> fine Friday night. Nope. Uh, recently, we actually upgraded to a couple cameras. You know, we got an audience going on. Go on strike. Get the fuck uh, out of here. Can I, can I help you? Anyways, to get the night started, um, yo, happy happy 20th, bro. Oh, my thank goodness. You. Yes. Yes. Yo, yeah, can I ask a question real quick to start it off? Go yeah. ahead. Yeah. Uh, wait, who's 20 here? I mean, I think everyone except you. No, no, like Sean's not Sean, twenty. Sean, Sean, yeah, Sean's seventeen. How you're not guys, twenty either. Huh? No, I'm not twenty yet. Okay, How do so you guys feel? Was it a, was it a weird birthday 17. for you, bro? I told, did, did, I already told you, bro. Yeah. I had, I had like an anxiety attack a month before I turned twenty because I was I had like an anxiety attack the day of. Really? Wait, wait. I texted you about it. I asked you. I was like, how did you feel? Did you text me the night you were turning 20 or the night before I you, you turned 20? It was like 20? two nights after I turned 20 that I was tripping out low key. Because like... Yo, low key. I thought this was a question about me. Okay, or, thanks, or thanks or Carrie. Uh, well, it was a relative question for everyone turning 20, my guy. Oh, never mind. You know, just because you turned 20 Carrie, doesn't mean the whole world revolves around you. I feel like you might have... Did you have an anxiety attack? You might have had an... No. Yeah, you did. Yes, you did. Carrie doesn't really think about stuff, you know? He just kind of wings it. Oh, I think a lot, bro. Trust me. I'm in my head. What's your plans for 20 years old? What's your goals? I don't know. Like 50k subs, maybe. Nick, it's been like three months, dog. Six. <laughs> what the fuck? Huh? Sorry. You slacking, huh? Who is this guy? I don't have any he goals. I've never thought of my goals yeah, for. Yeah, yeah. 20 so you years turned old. 20, and we were like, oh, you were you were only excited about it. You were not like, fuck, dude. Like, well, I was like a teenager. I was thinking about my day. You know, what the fuck am I gonna do? Because all my friends are working on a Monday. <laughs> you had a sick birthday. <laughs> he was just, so I was like, he was just thinking about the, the, oh, the just that day. Yeah, that bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, I want to have a lit ass birthday. So I called up Owen because he doesn't work right now. So I was like, fuck yeah, let's go. That's a vibe. <laughs> yeah, went to the beach. Had a few tall cans, you know, yeah, and, just and just smoked a blunt. Was that one of the best birthdays? You, like one of the better birthdays you've had in the past like five years? Um, probably. probably. Yeah, I'd say so. Because I've I'd had some so. shi- like, w- w- like I don't. I never you, had a you've had some party. shitty birthdays. I've never had a birthday party. I've had one birthday party in like uh, when I would turn seven. In that has to be a lie. There's no, no way. When have we had a birthday? I've known you. I've oh, known what, you, you have an awkward day for a birthday. Yeah, it's the day after lie. Christmas, so it's fucked. Oh, so yeah. I had one yeah. birthday party. I had a yeah. jumper. I had an Oreo <laughs> cheesecake or an Oreo. Co- so you uh, got a Christmas Eve. My brother fought his best friend David Boucher. He's a father now. He had a father today. Is he famous? David Boucher? No, he's definitely no, not. No, that's, that's Bobby Boucher. Today. That's Bobby oh, yeah, Boucher. Bobby Boucher. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, who? Wait, do you know who Bobby Boucher is? No. Okay. Yeah. Uh, it sounds famous. It sounds like a famous name, though. That's Where like is Bobby Boucher Wait, from? Isn't it Boufflé? I don't know. No, oh, that's Buble. Michael Buble. Oh. Yeah, that's a, Michael that's Buble. a sick Christmas man, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. He sings a Christmas he's song. A Christmas man. No, Michael Buble. Bro, that's that's Buble. Ricky Sanchez. Ricky Bobby. Oh, there's a lot of people. You're Who's Ricky that? Sanchez, Who's the really Ricky good Sanchez. chef? Who's the chef? Bobby. Frank Bobby Sinatra. Bobby 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 Frank Bobby Sinatra. Bobby Frank Sinatra. Frank Sinatra. There we go. Frank Sinatra's not the Christmas man, but he does make some really fucking yeah. good music. Yeah, that's logic. Frank there. Sinatra has a Christmas if you're song, over bro. Forty-five, and he you does. Listen to but I did not listen Frank to Frank Sinatra. 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 Do you Yo, need to listen to Frank hey, Sinatra? No, my brother does, and I just no. Frank listen. Sinatra's good as fuck. Hold on, dude. hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna music. let you in on a secret. If you are ever in the car with a girl and you play Frank Sinatra, no. Mm, no. What? Okay, you're high it, as fuck on the show. Yeah. She's gonna think she's gonna think you're sophisticated. She doesn't know who Frank Sinatra is. Exactly. She's gonna be hitting her fucking jewel, thinking about like. Hey, you the guys. Next Jersey Shore you guys don't care. Bro. You guys don't care if your girls like hit nicotine, huh? Like you guys are like it doesn't really bother you since you guys will do it, right? I don't it, do it. I don't. Does it bother you if a girl's like constantly hitting nicotine? Do Does it ever bother you? Who, who hits nicotine? I mean, if she's like Sean. Okay, yeah, you guys don't out. hit Nick, but for huh? if she's like Sean and starts freaking out, then maybe yeah. What do you mean? She starts no, no, no. Out? He's saying yeah. she hits nicotine. Just I said as she. Much as yeah, no, 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 no. I'm saying if a girl hits nicotine a lot. Are you gonna look at her differently? I yes. hate to say it, but probably. Yes. Really? It's so fucked up. Yes. Yeah, I really. Would. Wait, 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 wait. Are you saying? Are you talking about if she hits nicotine just in general? If she does it a lot? You know those people who post like ten puffs on their stories and they're like, "Oh my god, great!" Like if it's like Ooh, that, that's who embarrassing. Who does that? Oh, don't. Gosh, nah, it's cool. Name? It's cool. No, no, no. Wait, no, what, no, what, no, what does that no, mean? What does I don't that mean? be doing posting that. Posting ten puffs on their story. Like, like people who are addicted oh, like that, bro. Like they're going. They're looking forward to go buy one, and they're looking forward to have one for the weekend. They're like, "I need this for the weekend." Yeah, I stopped hitting. I stopped. Yo, Gary, Gary, girl, girl. Okay, cool. And
He was like scratching oh my God, his I mean, I, have, I, have I mean, when I go to a party, okay. bro. So I mean, I yeah, no, that's it's an so special listen, occasion. So listen, okay, for me, cool. for me having, for me, you know, having, Thanks, having asthma. Yes. If I'm seeing a girl hitting nicotine, I definitely look at her kind of like hey, she's gonna kiss you and you're gonna not, not be able to breathe. You know what Nick <laughs> said once? Nick was like, went up to me. He's like, oh, bro, shit. I respect all you guys because. You guys look so cool hitting all that because I have <laughs> asthma and I can't. He was so so sad. Sad. We were in, we were we were sophomores or juniors. I don't know. It was like the second party I ever been to, bro. And, and some girl, some girl was like, I was talking to some girl or whatever, and they were passing around like the nicotine device. And she's like, "Oh, you want to hit?" And I was like, "Oh no, I'm okay." And she was like, "Oh, like why?" And I was like, "I was like, I have asthma." <laughs> she just, she's like, you can, "She's like, you cannot lay it down in bed. Yeah, huh? Yeah, you will run out of breath." Yeah, well, she kind of okay, chuckled. Okay. She didn't laugh. Did she, she like? Did she say like, "Have you ever smoked weed?" Yes, and but I didn't at that time. I wasn't smoking oh, weed gotcha. at that time. But he said, "Wait, he did wait." So she looked down up. on you because you didn't hit nicotine. I don't think she looked down, but she chuckled. And well, she looks down anyways. Fuck you know what I mean? Chuckle. That oh, wow. <laughs> oh, fuck it out. Welcome to Subbert's <laughs> Talks. That's that's about it for That's tonight. fucked up. That was really that funny. That was pretty funny. That was pretty fucking funny. I'm not hey, hey, guess who's editing now so <laughs> I can put it in. <laughs> <laughs> Any, hey, hey, hey. What if, what if uh, a girl was smoking cigarettes at a party? That's what I was going to ask. Okay. That's, that's what I was going to ask. Why is, there, why, is there is why is there a difference? Why is there Why is there a difference? Because cigarettes are cigarettes, bro. No, it's like a joke. No, no, no. That's, that's a stupid plug. question. Why is there a difference with Sean? I know for a fact. Wait. Okay, what? Carrie, you, you don't have a girlfriend. Carrie, there is uh, like a like a like a semi cute girl hitting a hitting a puff. There's like a super bad girl, maybe like two years older than you, hitting a cigarette. What what is your like what is your uh, plan of action? I'm intimidated. I'm gonna oh be intimidated. God. Uh, I'm grossed out. Pipe on any cost, bro. What? No matter no matter <laughs> no matter what the taste of tobacco. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Um. um I don't know, bro. Like I have to like. You might get lung cancer after that night. Holy shit. Bro, I'm not kissing no girl that has cigarette breath. Have you ever have you, have have you ever kissed ever a girl? Have you ever yeah. kissed a girl who smoked cigs? No, I have. I have. Actually. I have. You, I have not. You taste it. You I taste have it not. for sure. I have not. I'm have, telling have you, I have, and it tastes exactly like how I would picture kissing you. We should just try oh, it and yeah? test it out. Wait. I mean, all right. You have got, you, you ever kissed pat? a girl? Have you ever kissed a girl that was smoking stuff? What? Stugs? Stugs. Have you kissed a girl that Stug? had been smoking Stugs? Do people call it Stugs? Yeah, I mean, yeah. If you don't know what Stug is, it's a fucking Okay, uh, no, but back to, like, back to the question, I just think, like, it's a generational thing, you know? Like, our parents all smoke cigarettes, and we don't know how vapes are. Like, I know, like, because most of us... Dude, vapes are probably just as worse as and cigarettes, Yeah, because it's only like, been around for, like, what, like, 15 years, right? That, and it's just metal. You're just yeah. Since, like, yeah. 2004, 2005. Yeah, That's bro. like the OG days. You know, though, like those bro. blue pens, those yeah. blue do you, ni- nicotine yeah. like pens. Yeah. Do you think in like, ones? do you think in like, those are like twenty the first years, ones. vapes are gonna be gone? It's to be some other shit. No, nah, I think I think electronic yeah, devices, no like electronic clue, vapes. The, the the sound they um, there's the a study about Jules. They spent years figuring out the sound of how you inhale it. What? No like, way. Yeah, yeah. There's a, it's That's on Netflix. Weird. They, everything about that device, that Jewel device, is made to be addictive. <laughs> it's fucking ridiculous bro, how much time and effort they put into that shit if you see a girl smoking stoves at a function mm-hmm. and she's really really pretty like you'd probably go up to her r- you you probably go up to her regularly would the cigarette have any effect on that really like yeah, any effect that's disgusting I bro, feel super I'm bad not, for that but I'm I, telling you like I guess it's I guess I don't it's know a, like a not like not a good thing like I, I, I just don't find that attractive I guess so wait wait no no no. So you, you know how you wouldn't. Uh, so that cigarette does have an effect on you. Yeah, because I think if I think someone's hot, I want to kiss them. Obviously, weed. right? Yeah, like, exactly. Like, I'm not gonna kiss someone with. Like, I just think because of when you're growing up, cigarette breath. You know the you know? whole like cigarettes are weird. awful. Just don't weird. smoke. Don't do drugs. I think that is a huge fucking. Our reason age why right now, so we're not disgusting. even 21. Our stigma that we grew up with is gross. What yeah, I think that's just the reason. Because when I was younger, that was so bad. Like I never learned about vapes or anything, but it was just cigarettes are awful. Don't drink alcohol. Those two things. I guess alcohol Question. just kind of came in the mix. What if? Uh, Let's say you weren't dating Taylor or whatever, right? Girls smoking a backwood or something like that. Would that have an effect? Would you be like, well, okay, fine. Would you just think she's less attractive, I guess? A she's just, with no she's just smoking. Is she just, yeah, just smoking like know. a That's blunt really or something? my style. Would you find her less attractive? Yeah, a little bit. Oh, wow. I just not my style. Like, it depends how much they're smoking. Like, if they're, like, smoking all the time. That's just not me. Like, I don't want to hang out with someone who's high 24-7. That's just not what I do. I totally want to agree with Sean, but, like, we probably look like such pussies to, like, 
I don't think it's, but it's just not my type. Like, it's not your type. I'll we agree. grew up in a different like uh, state. Okay, look, of, uh, I'll agree cigarette. with the cigarette thing, but I'm not a not the blunt. I, I, I wouldn't find a girl like so I'd still find a girl attractive. She's it's just like yeah. I said. It's just not my style. Oh know? no 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 I'm no. no. Weed, yeah, but a backwood. I thought you meant just like a pure backwood, like just pure tobacco. No, is she smoking it by herself or like is she smoking with friends? Because she's smoking. Damn, she's just smoking it by herself. Yeah, Says something if she's smoking it by herself, you know. Nah, she can handle like a lot of weed. She can handle fucked on a weed. Smoke yeah, a back like, uh, by myself on 420, bro. No, so that's more yeah. honestly, no. That that means I she's died. just a straight up like stoner, and like she yeah. probably doesn't get shit done. Hey, I mean, not nah, okay. I I used to hate on like weed like that, yeah, but there's some there's some, there's some productive yeah. like weed smokers. Oh, some people can. Be but productive. I think it's very rare. That's yes. why. Yes. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I haven't smoked in like a long time, bro. I think it's based on your maturity if you can handle like smoking yeah. weed a lot daily. <coughs> or not definitely because I was productive at, like we all used to go to school yeah, you proved we you all proved? used to go to school high as fuck yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Austin, Austin, right. you proved everything yeah. I knew about life wrong you okay yeah. maybe Austin. it was Austin. 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 maybe yeah. it was just you maybe it was just you you, <laughs> you have proved everything that I hey, thought I'm with you Austin I'm with you dog you have proved to me that you can do drugs not go to school you can Actually, show up halfway to school. Like, you can do whatever the fuck you uh, want and get away with 35% it. 35%. And you look. And look year. what you're doing oh now. Oh, God. Actually, I heard that you didn't show up to school for squat your senior year. For squat? It's an old saying. The fuck for is squat. Is that yeah, a you know, I know, I know what you're squats, saying, bro. For squat. You know for squat. Yeah, yeah, yes, yeah, yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah. It means that you never went to school. I never for had for a full, I never had a full five shit. days. That's crazy. <laughs> that's a cap. I swear Dude, no, that's not a cap. I was the my senior year. I never had a full five days. Like that's not even that bad. Like, there's worse people out there. There are Thank some worse people. I always got you. But um, when I was on the live stream the other night, bro, I had like three DMs. Like, and you remember? DMing me how oh, inspiring I was on the live. And I was just ran- it was after Devin's house. And I was Dude, just like, you, I was like, you fuck weren't high saying school. anything. Bro, were you? my DMs, bro. They were like, they were like, and some guy DMing me was like, how do I become a salesman like you? And I was like, don't go to school. I was like, <laughs> do, do <laughs> drugs. Don't like, go to school. <laughs> go smoke weed. Work at a skate shop. Um, talk to an Asian. Be man a fucking that comes asshole in. to everyone you meet. Be mean. an asshole to everyone, but don't burn bridges. Do you <laughs> like, do you remember it. when this dude? Uh, I don't know if he stole his mom's car. Who just got it? Didn't have his license. I don't think he even have his had his permit. Oh and yeah. His yeah. windshield Fresh. wipers weren't working, and it was raining. And it was nighttime, and your ass got out the side of the car and was going like this on his fucking windshield. <laughs> I was? Yes, bro. I you too. That's that when I was so scared. I don't know. Do you, know. you think we were like bad kids in high school? Not at all. Compared to other people, bro. Kid. My brother, my brother, bro. So I was oh, sleeping in my house. My brother was a, a junior at the time. And he sold a lot of weed at uh, our Dude, high school that we went to. Dude, you might want to be careful what you say. He's guy. fucking like almost thirty now. I don't. Yeah, but I that could ruin his future. Yeah, but that could. He. D- they don't know who I'm talking about. My last name is. I'm just telling you to be name. careful. That's it. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, uh, Stop I'm in, looking out for him. Bro. I'm in. <laughs> I won't do it ever again. I promise. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> can't s- can't sleep on my oh ground my. anymore for four days in a row. <laughs> go. I was go, like go, go, eleven. I'm not letting Messi near you ever again. I thought my parents were going through a divorce and I had to sleep at a friend's house. Fucking asshole! <laughs> Why'd you bring that up? It, it, it wasn't. You smoked weed outside of the house. <laughs> I was twelve and stressed. You left, am I gonna you bring left, up the mess? You left the, the you left the peanut butter unwatched. <laughs> he brought it up. I, I was off it. my medication. <laughs> <laughs> anyways, go ahead, go ahead, anyways, go ahead, go ahead. Uh, we got robbed. My brother got robbed of like uh, like three ounces of weed, and my mom had to act like we had security cameras. And all I hear is her screaming like, "I have you on camera!" And then I guess like three. She said Asian kids. We live in Fuller. T- yeah. Aunt you question. told the story already on podcast. On the podcast? Yeah, you did. I just wanted yeah. to say. Oh, really? Yeah. I was going to let you keep going. Yeah, but right. Someone stole weed from my garage. <laughs> and Anyways. I'm just saying that we were not that crazy in high school. I feel like. <laughs> no, we definitely were I think we had fun. I think we, we had, had fun, fun for sure. But we, we weren't as gnarly. Yeah, we, we were had bad had social kids. media and everything was on video. Well, I think we lived. Like Fullerton's like an interesting place because at least like the school we went to, um, the high school, like we have a lot of smart like. Kids who go yeah, to, like, we had two different sides of like the yeah spectrum. we have a lot of like we had yeah. two different sides who of go to like prestigious schools and then we have this like the Austin's. other side no 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 oh. Austin, okay you can't you Fuck. can't even compare Austin to, like some kids that we went to school say, with don't even put me but you know what I mean like hard. damn that's so, fucked up man. I'm <laughs> kidding you fuckhead God even Carrie, even your your high school bro like oh dude definitely. there was some crazy stuff going on bro. I don't even want. I don't even. Know no, just what like to say like when, school, like bro. people were like selling drugs. Like obviously oh, like, that's oh, a part oh, of oh. it, but like 
people you wouldn't like expect, and it's doing crazy. Were there yeah, kids? bro. Were there other kids selling drugs at Fullerton? We didn't, oh, we didn't have hella oh, kids yeah. selling drugs. Yes, we did. Yes, that? we did. When bro. we were when we were younger, we yeah, had hella okay. kids. Hey, hey, when we became hey, like hey. upperclassmen, no one was selling drugs no Sophomore more. Sophomore year, the fool that came from Fullerton High School and got everyone on Xanax, bro. Dude, I know you're talking about. We talking were all about. high as fuck during. You keep saying no. We we it was just you. I was high as fuck during lunch and you. Was it was it that the brother? Yeah. But what I was gonna say about Fullerton was Fullerton was on a whole different spectrum, bro. Like like from Fullerton. Some kid a year younger than us. When me and you were at that spring break, uh, the spring break party, uh, we were on that one drug that made us like hug a lot. It was weird. Um, <laughs> so <laughs> wait, that's wait, 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 wait. You need to say that one more time. Say that one more time. Say it. Say it he was on a drug that you guys hugged a lot. Yeah, it was called hug. Oh, gotcha, gotcha, yeah. gotcha, gotcha. What's weird about it, bro? No, yeah, I, I, know, know. I, I just so I um, know that, that, that guy that we saw shoot that kid was a year younger than me, so two years younger than you, and he fucking took my um, my ex like two years ago to like homecoming. She's like, oh yeah, that was the kid that shot that other kid, and I was like, I'm like, they we play it up, off. We grew up at Sunny Hills, and we we're like, yeah, this kid sold Xanax one time yeah. at recess. Yeah. And then this kid's <laughs> over. This kid's three miles kids. down harbor, fucking shooting kids. And I'm like, <laughs> there's a fucking spectrum here, bro. Definitely, there's there's bro. a spectrum here. Like we there's did not. We went to a fucking privileged ass school. Like, but at the yeah. same time, we didn't. It's just, but at it the same time, we smoked you guys, weed and like drank. You guys think? You guys think it's getting shit. like like worse and worse in a sense? Oh, I have no, no idea. Well, I don't think it's well at Fullerton, for sure. Bro. Really? At high school? Fullerton oh. High School? You think it's getting worse and worse? I don't know about it getting oh, worse and I've worse. Seen, I've Fullerton seen, yeah. definitely, bro. I, mean, I was a freshman. We were way, and like the upperclassmen, they were way like better than us. Bro, as soon as I became like a junior, the freshmen were like dicks, bro. See, opposite. you know what's crazy? They no, 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 but you know what's crazy, Sean, though? It was kind of like the, the seniors went crazy for us. And then we didn't do shit. And then we didn't do shit, but then, and then I feel like it reversed again. No, nah, actually just, not. Uh, you got like know, a year on, year off. Yeah, of crazy yeah I shit. think it's kind of like that. It could yeah. just be like that. Hey, is it just me or like the classes every year gain smaller and smaller? It's like shorter. See, you think that's an effect? I always thought that was an effect because they seem so old. And nah, big. bro, motherfuckers, when we were seniors, no, dude, those dudes were way bigger than us. Like, like now, I like that. Now, freshmen, you, if you, you mean, took, yeah, freshmen, those seniors, dude, were if you took like the high average, like the average weight and height, you think that ours is smaller? The soccer team, our soccer team, bro, those dudes would have wrecked us as seniors. When we were seniors and they were seniors, they would have wrecked us. Actually, yeah, that's true. That should be a diversion of perception. No, no. These dudes, these motherfuckers were like. You saw them when you were 14. So no, but these, like the you, Luke, that's dude, what I'm saying. All, bro, like, but like, like masses, the whole bro. soccer team, bro. Okay. Oh, even the basketball team was huge. Like, yeah, that's like, what I'm saying. Pulls, the two center backs, yeah, so everyone yeah. was fucking huge. They were just tall. Yeah, it was when just more came, competitive. When we came to my house. yeah, it all seemed more competitive. Um, in your guys' opinion, do you guys think high school in general is toxic? Like yes. high school in general, not no. the high school necessarily you went to, but like the high school in like high school in general. Do you think it's toxic to kids? Yes. It's yes. an environment. Like, it's an environment yes. full it's of fifteen or fourteen a, through eighteen year olds. Yes, so like everyone's just and you're going there every yeah, day. It's secure yeah. every year. And they yeah. make it like a nine fucking months. It, it, the social construct that's built throughout a high school, like that it's parameter, weird, bro. is super So weird, I got a question. But it's fun. I mean, it's what you okay. Have to so do. you guys say high schools, high schools toxic and all that, right? What if you guys were reason. homeschooled for a good for high school? No, though. I'm saying for a good Shit, reason. Going a lot into more stress and not no drama in my fucking You're life. You're saying that you'd rather be homeschooled high school than no, go to no. high school? No. Bro, I've had Probably three. Not, I've had three jobs this last year. I've stress. had three jobs this last year. It feels like being the new kid in class, and I feel like high school kind of teaches you just be like, mm. do your shit, kind of figure out how to talk to new people, kind of figure out how to be the you know what it is. Of the I class, feel like I feel like high school teaches more to like tune out the other like things and people you feel me like yeah. i get like what you're saying like you know make like certain amendments and all that and all that type like make yeah. connections but i feel like high school really especially i feel like for me and for other people i feel like it teaches you to like tune out the motherfuckers who tune are like making you insecure and then and all when that. you go into an office workplace you realize like i don't want to talk to him because I know what type of person he is. Exactly. I want to hang out around this guy who fucking runs the company. Exactly. I want to hang out next to this guy who fucking has the most sales a week. Exactly. You kind of pick and choose who you want to hang out with. And yeah. Who's in your really? You think point. high school taught you yeah. all that? I mean, if I hung out you're with socially and I was just trying okay, to okay, okay, to everything I say. You See, know what I'm saying? Now, the friends that I hung out with so, brought me down because I was more of a social guy in high school. So that's why my exactly. kids are fucking dog shit. Yeah. If I chose to hang out with the quiet kids that at the time when I was so mature, I didn't understand that, hey, these guys are going to be successful. Now in these like in this new uh, kind of like new classroom when I'm in, I kind of see, oh, this guy's gonna be successful. I want to talk to him. Gotcha. I want to hang out around him because gotcha. I know he's only gonna carry me. Yeah. You know? no, yeah. Or I'm gonna hang out with fucking uh, Luke over here hitting my fucking sore in air and the stuzzy in class and like it's not doing me okay, any good. Okay, yeah, that's a lie. 
<laughs> you know what I'm. You but know what I, mean. I I understand what you're saying. Like I agree with you. Like hang like the people you surround yourself with are important. But I I feel like I, like high school I didn't like learn that much honestly. You think you think you could have done no. really? Like okay wait wait I'm gonna I'm gonna are I'm you okay. serious? Hold on hold on hold on. You think you could have done without high school if it didn't mean that uh, if you could get into a good college still? Wait what? Does that make sense? Wait are you talking about academics or like being social with people or Both. anything in general? I guess. Well I felt like honestly I was just kind of like going through just going it, through like, the motions. Yeah like yeah. Well, it was yeah. anything monumental yeah. in my life. Like obviously I made friends like, or like yeah. maybe like lifetime friends. Yeah. That's probably the biggest thing. But other than that, I think I've learned not really. I think I've learned more from all you guys than than anything being in that environment. I think gotcha. for that four years we didn't really realize what we learned because we went in as fucking children. We were in eighth grade fucking with another grade below us mm. we came in and there was these fucking like 18 year olds that were oh. smoking weed drinking and we were like fuck dude this summer i w- fucking went to camp land and like rode bicycles around so like <laughs> you're really thrown huge now i gotta worry about getting run yeah, up on for your freshman year you know, you exactly. now, now, now you're kind of thrown in this like that, that toxic world because it's like these people above you are judging you you're exactly. trying to impress them the whole time exactly and this is a constant cycle and um I think it's just like a, it's like a little a ma- society. It's a, it's a matter of how it much. Is. It's a matter it's of how much the little mini society. Oh yeah, for sure. The principal See, makes it as I if it's like its own fucking town. It's its and own all these kids town. are there. We have it's prep like you rallies. You gain respect by doing something you do. I think that's yeah, kind of scary though because we like, because like you know you say. No, we that we. You gotta stop saying we, dude. Another eye. I've never had sex in the bathroom. Listen, listen, because I just feel like it's strange how I feel like most people, if not fucking everyone, except the people like peak in high school, basically, will come out of high school saying high school's toxic and all that. But they'd still rather go through that than go than be homeschooled. You feel me? Because I would still rather do those four years in high school than be homeschooled, bro. Yeah, no shit. I would but, why would you be homeschooled, Oh, yeah, bro? definitely. Because, yeah. well, what, what were you saying earlier? You, you kind of thought about it for a second, right? Like, when I first asked, you were kind of like, oh, hold up. Year. Like, because it does relieve the stress. It does relieve, like, everything else. I don't else. regret going to high school at all. I think high school, I learned so much, you know, like, not just about academics, but, like, about life and about friends and like we're who are the right I didn't learn shit know? through academics. We're doing Sorry. something wrong. That's why I said no, like not even academics. I I thought like being socially inept with friends and able to talk to people and know how to talk and it just yeah. it's it's another way of you yeah, way going around the world when you're older to talk to I don't know whoever the fuck yeah, you want. Yeah, we I'm love being in a tribe and I think each grade level that grows, I mean, we all grow with each other. We all grow with like 200 kids, 300 kids and I think we feel really comfortable let me say something. in that fact. Let me and say when something. you're being homeschooled, you're growing with your little <laughs> brother. Let me, let me say something. Yeah, because you haven't been talking this whole okay. time. Okay, <laughs> those four years, those four years you were in high school, what if you could do those four years but instead you travel the world? But travel the world. Yeah, oh, I, I travel which, the world. No, 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 no. Which do you think <laughs> you'd benefit from more? Traveling, traveling the world. Traveling the world. When yeah. I went to Europe I last year, so holy much shit, history. Dude, yeah. My, yeah. my brain. Dude, history. History. studying abroad. 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 I always say the wrong one. Studying abroad. abroad. Isn't that abroad. sick though? Abroad. Wouldn't huh? that be dope if you could go to Spain for a fucking year? Bro, have you got? You've been out. You've been out of country before. I'm assuming. I've been out. I know you have Carrie Luke. Yeah, bro. It's the fucking. Yeah, it's awesome. I've never been out. The only thing I remember that like the, that that hit me the most was flying over the um, fucking Atlantic Ocean, Atlantic and, Ocean and, yeah. and seeing like icebergs. Really, I was I was nineteen. And I was like, I've never fucking seen an iceberg my whole life. Mm-hmm. Yeah, wow. I would, uh, and I was like, I've seen them on television, and you, you know that they're there. And then when you really see, and then like landing, and then like seeing the London Eye, seeing the fucking just being in a different place is fucking. Be, and weird. then like talking to people, bro. I, was, I remember I was outside yeah. of a fucking pub, shit face. And these guys were talking about me about California, and they thought I was a fucking like superstar. Legend, bro. huh? Yeah, they were yeah, talking about. about uh, yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah, of course. I told them I was an actor. <laughs> I was like, yeah, subscribe. Uh, you did not tell them that you was. You're like, I, yeah, I, I was I, in a frozen place. It was, it was like, it was like two in the morning. Way. I was shit faced, bro. And um, I just remember like how crazy I was talking to these forty year old fucking British blokes. Yeah, and they're so interested in me. <laughs> 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 I think you belong in London, bro. If I'm being quite honest. Honestly. I think you are a London so boat. You're such no. a I have dad's a, son, we, we, have a, we have a house out there now. Rest in peace with my poppy. And you, have my a, nanny. you have a room in there but in that house? Yeah, I got three bedrooms, bro. And this fucking nice-ass town, Yorkshire. It, so it's your house. Yorkshire! It's me, Danielle's, and Ashley's. It's, it's, our, it's our home now. And I'm begging not to sell it because I want to go there like once a year, bro. It is the dopest fucking house ever. And, Can you pay uh, for the it? The pub's Can there. Can you pay for it? It's already paid off. The pub oh. there is it's called an armpit. It's called the pit. Cause it's like all the mine. It's called work. the armpit or the pit. It's called the pit. I call okay. it the armpit because it's fucking American. <laughs> all the all the coal workers, all the mine workers, go to the pit, bro, and just get shit faced. Do they sing like sea shanties? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they go crazy in the pub. You know that one? So you, know, you know that one chant that's all over TikTok? Like, 
when oh, no, the man, no, 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 the fairy no, no. man comes, and dun dun. dun, dun. Anyway, I'll show I you guys have no later. idea. What I know what you're talking about, bro. I'll show you guys later. <laughs> I'll show you guys later. <laughs> <laughs> Going out of country is cool. I wish I could go to like more places. Just travel. Go to Bolivia. To answer Same. your question, Same. though, Same. I think Same. we'd all say no. yes. You'd like, all, fuck. we'd all benefit from going traveling for yeah. four yeah. years yeah. and going to high school. Yeah. 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 If it was all the homies for four years going, bro, imagine we were in Spain right now. Like we'd be clubbing at like 16. Dude, it's crazy because I see pictures, and you know how everything is so close together. I had a yeah in Europe. Yeah in Europe. You had a girl in my class oh. and she was talking about okay yes and she was talking about i don't want to talk about man lost, i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry she was talking about what i'm sorry she was talking about what sean don't hey, sub you, uh, you want to happen sean 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 wait sean stop kicking the camera bro yo sage sage is the camera still good this motherfucker kicked it What's up, kicked it again bro yes bro did you get my gatorade Hey, it's Wyatt here. God damn. What's up, Wyatt? Wyatt. All right, Wyatt, put on the fucking headphones. Let's so see how you sound. How was Nom? Wyatt, right, you look okay. big as fuck. Yeah, Wyatt, you look fucking Yo, Sean just upgraded. <laughs> Sean just upgraded. Sean, just no, upgraded. Look at Sean and Carrie right now. Sean. Or, yeah, Holy shit. Wyatt's hey. arm is as big as... Holy fuck, Wyatt. <laughs> put him on. No, but he's got, he's got the nice, like, bicep ball. Like, that shit just didn't... I can't do it, bro. I, I you can't You gotta, you gotta, you know, like... Cut a little bit and then oh yeah no, wait so why why wait, can we talk a little bit about like his military experience well we we kind of have but I like, know you guys we, already have and I still haven't listened to hold the on before we get before we get into that why so into how it, was bro. your high school experience dog how was my high school he was experience? on the water polo how was team. your lit. high school experience it was it Owen's was laughing so hard right now bro <laughs> I don't I just know I hear this I kind of just chilled in high school I was like all my best friends were a bunch of fucking nerds and played video games all the time kind of video games. Uh, Minecraft, know, just, oh, dude, World of War. Yeah, we're Minecraft. Minecraft. Lit, yeah. yeah, we. I don't know. We'd play just a bunch of dumb video dude, games. Dude, I could totally oh. see you playing Club Penguin and being like, <laughs> "My fucking what? pebbles, Puffle. 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 No, I'm, I'm a fucking... car jitsu master." Yo, <laughs> oh, what are you? Talking? Why you no. can't get on here talking like that? No. Yes. <laughs> You're gonna get so much pussy back in Japan after that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, why? Okay, in your opinion, bro, would you call high school in general toxic? No. No. Why do you say no? Well, because I don't know. I like I. I'm just. Were a, you a bully? No. You no. were a bully. I huh? hung out with bullies. Like, the bullies. bullied kids. Like, uh, those were my <laughs> shit. <laughs> and then I also like half of my high school experience was with nerds, and then the other half was like with water polo Wait, jocks. Were so. you like? Were you pretty like buff in high school? Like were no. you? No. Oh, and I was always I was always pretty lean, right? Like. He wasn't, wasn't looking like this, was he? Five percent okay. body fat. Oh my! Oh, okay. I what thought you said you were. No, <laughs> was not. What? Uh, what How much did you weigh though? Like one. I used to weigh about like what probably in high so school one eighty. Now oh, that's I'm not like, bad. Damn, that's that's, 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 that's big. That's, that's At what, big. what point in high school did you know that you wanted to do like uh, military? At that point. Oh no point. No point. No, like I you no were idea. you a senior just like fuck I don't know what I'm gonna do like I'll just commit the next four years of my life to fighting the noms. Okay, let's get this straight, bro. Because apparently he he isn't enlisted in Vietnam. You're not? I've never been to Vietnam. Yeah. He, he went to Japan, bro. Yeah. Yeah. It's Japan. What war are we fighting right now? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what is this? Are you in the Navy? You're in the Navy, right? I'm putting I'm it in. I'm in the Marine Corps. Okay. You're in the Marine Corps. Oh, fucking savage. So you, how, how much of your life do you live on the ocean? Uh, it depends. They'll send us out on ships. Uh, in the past, it's been... Uh, two to three months. I've done that twice. I'm just sailing, huh? Yeah, just sailing, yeah. stopping in like Thailand, Australia. Places so, like that. Um, in my understanding, when you're when you're on that boat, it, it, Marines kind of sit back, right, and the Navy kind of takes over uh, all surveillance around this new COVID bill that's passing right now. Uh, with all the UFO information that has to be released in what fuck nowadays, 160 days from the Pentagon. Uh, what what are your thoughts? What are your thoughts about? <laughs> You're all gonna the get him killed. <laughs> no, what, I don't, first of all, I don't know anything about UFOs. Or anything. That's he, what he says but every time. He, he knows know, so much. If he's calling them UFOs, he definitely knows what the I said fuck they UFOs. are. UFOs. Oh, I thought you said UFOs. UFOs. You said yeah, UFOs, bro. Like, if he said Mofo UFOs. UFOs. I would dog? believe you. Know, <laughs> no, I mean, wait, wait, wait. What were you? What were you trying to get at, dog? With the yeah, COVID yeah, bill? I was yeah, just what were The Pentagon passed a law. All the Pentagon video footage comes from the Navy, so I thought he was in the Navy. I didn't know he was in the Marine Corps. No, he doesn't. He's not in the Navy, and he's not enlisted in Vietnam. The 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 talk on the ship when it comes down to conspiracies what is the talk of the ship like when you guys are in the fucking uh the dining hall uh, there's got to be conspiracy talk coming about when you're at your age you know you, you guys are going to talk about some like low-key government shit so what is it uh mainly with like conspiracy theories it's it's pretty tame we you know what when i was la so the last time i was on ship was around uh 
was around the time Epstein got suicided. Oh, no way. Yeah, God, so yeah. I was I was oh, just checking yeah. Facebook one day on Chip, and then I were reading about that. It, that Those are pretty much, or that was the most extreme conspiracy theory we talked about, if anything. It's just a bunch of people who are sad they're not home, and they're like, Man, I hear we're going to hear we're going to Bali next. It, really? Yeah, but we never go to Bali because <laughs> I'm a part of the group that makes up the rumors that we're going to Bali. <laughs> <laughs> like I got a question for you. So, like in the Marines and all that, bro, um, does that is it is like the consensus or like the majority of the people do they really just want to come home or do some people like actually like it like you know traveling and all that stuff? What would you say the majority is? Uh, I'd say a majority enjoy it while they're in. Uh, but they but they're waiting for their time to get out like yeah. like it's only four <laughs> years so they're kind of just accepting it mm. and it's not like sure they'd rather be home but is there know. is there any like depression on the ship that you've like oh. experienced like not not you yourself I mean like your friends or like oh, other yeah. shit yep I mean it and whether you it was Japan or on ship uh, you know that was always a serious thing that we uh, always were talking about mental health um, Pretty much, like, I think it was every week, every time we would go to shore, every time we had, like, a good, like, unit meeting, we would talk about, hey, mental health, yeah. go talk to the chaplain, you can talk to anyone, you can talk to your bosses, your NCOs, stuff like that. So, do you guys think it's a, wait, 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 hang on, hang on, hang on, there's a small C-shanties shower, fucking slap, dude. there's a small shower in the quarters, there's no, uh, I'm, I'm guessing you can't bring a female on board, and, um, you know. Onto the ship? Onto the ship. Wait, what do you, there yeah, are wait, 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 on so, so, so right women uh, serve on ships. Uh, no, no, no. That's not. I didn't say that. I didn't. You fucking misogynist. I did not say that. I said you can't masculinity. I said you can't bring women onto the ship. I said you can't bring women onto the ship. Rotate. I have a question. No, fuck out of here. I did not say that. I said you can't bring women on the ship. You can't go to Japan. Wait. Bring a fucking civilian on the ship. Oh, oh, oh. Right. Yeah. No, you can't. Yeah. Fuck out of here. Hey, why? I have a question. What's your Sandy Chicks is in the military. Y'all ever? You ever like thought about being like an elite sniper? Like this What the? Yeah, no, every once in a while I get a, a little motivational oh, shit. After that Call of Duty fucking campaign, huh? You just start hitting oh, it. Oh, yeah? yeah? Like Chris Kyle, though. Quick scopes. Good ass. No, like, I mean, so... Have you ever shot a sniper rifle? Not a sniper. You ever shot someone? Damn. No. Uh, have you killed anyone? He's lying to you guys, bro. You ain't in the military. <laughs> <laughs> Why? He's no, not. Hey, he's on high might, surveillance right, right now. So this might be a shocker for you guys, but like the military really doesn't do anything right now. We're pulling out of Afghanistan. He's I lying, think there's bro. like... <laughs> Fifteen thousand. <laughs> yeah, no. There's more. There's more National Guards in in the you know in in Washington right now than there is in Afghanistan and Iraq combined. I don't think that's true. That's true. It's, there's uh, I read it this morning. <laughs> you, read it, you read it this morning. Yeah. 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 Fact, fact check his ass. Yeah. Fact but check his ass. But I have to watch out. There's okay. There's okay. A couple thousand. There's, one, let's go, let's there's twenty thousand in Washington right now. There's twenty thousand. Yeah. Twenty thousand. Oh, never mind. You're totally right. Yeah. Yeah. There's twenty thousand National Guards. Yeah. Don't ever challenge him again, bro. You just yelled, challenge him. Challenge him. You're the fucking worst. So um. <laughs> what I wanted to ask was what masturbation. Is this guy? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that what you wanted to get to? I just wanted Kyle to stick to high school, man. <laughs> yeah, that's what you're edging towards. This guy Kyle. came into yeah. high school. He started. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. High yeah, school. Man, <laughs> Yo, whenever Wyatt Hobson just goes fucking south, so I, fast. What do you mean? You're Shit. asking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Austin's the one to ask about the army first. So, so you you left high school, got on a boat, went to Japan with a gun, and. Uh, did you like uh, what? What was your first experience with a foreign woman? Like, how was that? Because we're all used to the same women in Orange Bro. County. You know Questions what I mean? You missed these really talks, no, 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 Austin. No, no, no. You go you one way, you're like, talks. oh man. You so you get hey, off a boat. Wyatt, oh, did I? Wyatt, Wyatt, go Wyatt, go Wyatt, this is here. Austin, bro. He, he, yeah, you, welcome you think, to ADHD. You think yeah. you see the ball coming, bro? But you, you don't. Fuck no, I love it. It gives me the nerve. Yeah, we already talked. No, 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 do not. Oh, approximately two thousand. No, so no, 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 it's twenty thousand. No, they're 20, planning 000. on bringing twenty thousand. They're planning. Okay, hey, get fucking apologies. fact checked. Oh, same thing, right? Hey, okay, hey, fucking hey, fact twenty thousand. Okay. That's so, a So, right? so on Twitter, that's a you know, there's a bunch 20, of 000? there's a bunch of armed civilians trying to go to the Capitol on the nineteenth, and that's why they're bringing twenty thousand National Guard because I think they're going to go armed this time. Yeah, treason. However, bastards. we spend seventy five trillion dollars on national defense, but we can't fucking defend. Uh, that shitty capital. I, I don't give a fuck Whoa, about. Whoa, that's our capital, bro. No, what it's fucking doing? not. It's not our capital. It's, it's the, the people's the, building. Yeah, it's the trillionaires' capital, bro. They don't do shit about us. We're on TikTok, numbing our okay. mind and smoking weed. You know what? Weed. Okay, this this I'm gonna say. I'm gonna <laughs> ask one question about politics, and then we are gonna leave it. No, at that. I, I don't think. No, 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 no. It's nope. not. Don't worry about it. It's not gonna be something like crazy, like like some. Nah. Okay, so I'm taking a American government class right now. Okay, I'm taking American government class right now, and one of the questions uh, for like a little discussion was. Do you think our political system currently 
is uh, ran by elitists or is it what do you call it when it's run by like the populist thing it's a plural pluralism or something like that popularism you, guys, you sure about that yeah I'm sure. okay do you think our current it's political elitist. system is elitist as in the elites run like basically mm-hmm. a lot of the politics that go yep. on or do you think most of the power is still in the power of the people it's not in the power of the people. If, no. you, if you think that this political government's well, ran by the power of the people, you're 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 out of it completely. I feel like. Yeah, you idiot. Not not saying you're an idiot, but. Um, well, go go ahead and explain your point. Because uh, I said I said that it was elitist. Okay, to be to be completely honest, I um I I'm I'm not that smart to try to fight that argument, but I don't think it's ran by the people anymore. I I really just don't. Well, feel I think like it's it been. It's been ran, ran by the so much. by the elitist, elitist for a while. Bro, it's I mean, ran by uh, the media, bro. Media. It, oh, media too, definitely. What about, what about you, Why you, you thinking a little bit. You serve for your country and your people. He probably knows a good deal about this. You know? I don't... They I teach him yeah, right. I don't know <laughs> everything. <laughs> oh, oh, you served in the military, so you must yes, know that. Why, yes, Wyatt. Yes. You were, yes. you were at the yes. Bohemian Grove, yes. bro. I know you're right. Amendment. I was... Yeah, you're right. I was at the Bohemian Grove. Mm. Okay. I saw you, Hillary Clinton <laughs> naked. <laughs> no, you... What do you think? No, 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 no. Did you see Did you see Obama in the... Naked? The spiritual, like... Like, thing? Yes, what was he wearing? He's wearing like some like traditional like some costume, bro. Yeah, Have you guys ever heard of that? No. You never heard of the Bohemian Grove? Answer my question. <laughs> okay, well, <fuck. laughs> you Dude, I want to talk about the Bohemian Grove, bro. We can get You've to that after my question. That? Okay. Yeah, uh, I think for the most part, um, not not necessarily. I wouldn't I wouldn't say the government, but in most facets of life, whether it's like kind of the big tech agencies, yes, or, uh, bro. or like Walmart and Target lobbying to stay mm. open during a pandemic yeah. when small businesses can't not that i think either one should be open or closed yeah. but i think it's a little fucky that target can designate <laughs> themselves to do that over yeah what, what you said about the tech industry and the, and the tech gurus uh that shit's fucked up nowadays bro what they're a- they're able to mani- they're able to 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 predict what we're gonna think tomorrow morning when we wake up you know what i mean like I they have right. all this data built on us for the last like eight ten years and they see how we react to certain things, how long we watch a sad video versus how long we watch a happy video mm. versus how long we watch a funny video. Yeah. And they're building an e-identity about ourselves. Owen, Owen, what's the movie? Social Dilemma, social Dilemma bro. Oh, you guys watch it that? The Social it, Dilemma? Yeah. It, it, I knew it was fucked, but when, 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 when these ex-executives from oh, Google, yeah. Twitter, Facebook came out and was like, I feel nervous talking about this, but I'll talk about it. And when I was watching it, I was like, this can't be real, but like you, you, you kind of feel their nervousness and the, and you feel their uh, fucking desperation to get this out to us, our our fucking numb brains mm. that are still learning the academics Snowden. that America's taught us since the fucking eighties. We're learning the same shit since the eighties, bro, and they're not educating us on how social media affects us mentally, physically, and all that shit, bro. There's people depressed out there because of fucking Instagram. All right, so I got I got two things after that. Um, so one, I I challenge you to think about the fact that. I mean, in your own media, you hear about the U.S. doing this, selling your information. Yeah. But I just, I'd like to challenge you guys to think analytically. I will not whether join the military. Nope, oh, not, okay. nope, would never right. push you guys to do okay, that. Okay, go ahead. Oh, What's the challenge? We're good now. Go ahead. Whether that's What's the challenge? just happening in America. I'll take it. Like, no, that, no, 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 no. It's most worldwide. definitely not just happening in America. Yeah, 100%. Your mic's off. No one's selling your data, though. That's the thing. What's huh? up? It's, ad- it's advertisers buying your data. Shouts out Social Dilemma. It's that's what, that's you got to explain yourself. So um, I'm not going to defend this point, but it's just what I watched. So they're not selling your data. It's uh, They're selling advertisement uh, space. So you really like fucking like depressed videos because right now you just went through a breakup and they fucking somehow understand that you're going through that. So they're going to they're gonna push, a, they're gonna, they're gonna push a fucking Nike ad on your ass like multiple times because you're going to keep on watching these videos. So saying that they're selling data – uh, I don't think is accurate, but That's saying saying that they're selling here. your eyes. I mean, they're, they're all so all these indus- all, all these companies are in for is, is for your eye time. It's, it's yeah. for the time you stare at the screen. Yeah, that's accurate to the situation here in the U.S., but in countries like China, oh, yeah, where they're yeah, dealing yeah. with, or where they're like literally top notch, like eyes on you, like all the time, right? Yeah, where China's literally running out in the open concentration camps. Yeah, yeah. they're Muslim population. You yeah. you can build a score and you can't buy a bus ticket out of or a plane yeah. ticket out of China. Yeah. You can it's have like such a shitty social score. Some big brother shit right yeah, here. Yeah, you can't yeah. fly back to America. 
Yeah. Uh, sorry, I keep interrupting you. No, you're fine. That was all I was gonna say. I I honestly forgot what else I was gonna say. After you that. Gonna, you oh just the one you're gonna challenge us to think about if it happens not just here but other countries. Oh, you know what I was gonna. You mentioned Snow. One of you. Snowden. You. You Snowden. mentioned Snowden. Do you think Snowden's a hero or a traitor? Who's Ooh. Snowden? Uh, you right. know what's Who's crazy? Snowden? Okay, wait, hold on. Wait, I'm gonna tell Snowden, right? So he Edward Snowden, f- Edward. he was uh he worked at the NSA and a bunch of other agencies. He had access to top secret information. And basically, he gave it out. I th- I want to say it was for free or at, like he gave yeah. it out. He, he, he was gave ex marine, right? He was ex marine, or was he? He no, never. He, uh, he joined, never was. He, he never joined made the it. army and then he got kicked out during boot camp. Yeah, I thought it was. He but, never made it. But he then he ended it. up joining the NSA as like an IT guy. So yeah. he got his or he got all the access to top secret information and then gave it out to journalists. It wasn't necessarily like top secret information on like U.S. weapon systems, but it was on like. How the like US the government bombings. was watching? It was more. I know so there was more was, like it was uh, the rolling surveillance systems, yeah. but it was as or it was as well the bombing of like Reuters journalists in Iraq being mistaken for uh, like terrorists. Yeah, and yeah, like yeah, 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 yeah. Did you guys watch the movie? Yeah, yeah. now he lives yeah. in Russia. He's ch- he's gone, bro. He dude, the yeah. fact that he he's was able to go on a Joe Rogan podcast was insane. Oh that yeah, w- that was gnarly. that was a really good. That podcast. was crazy. That was yeah. super good. I need to watch that. Do you think he's a traitor? Do you think he's a I think, I think he's a patriot. Look, uh, honestly, oh, I'm be real with you. Okay, word. okay, so, so. No, I agree no. with you. I agree with you. Regarding Snowden, regarding Snowden, this is the only reason why I think he's a hero. Okay, I'm, when Obama <laughs> came into office, bro, remember, uh, I remember he said, because my parents were talking about like crazy, he said something about uh, the U.S. government surveillance over um, America and how it's going to be diminished. Like, you guys don't need to worry. Like, the government isn't watching you. But they were and everything, right? So technically, he was lying in a sense. He was lying. He was saying that we're not tapping your phones or anything like that. And Snowden came out later and dropped everything and let everyone know, no, like they are. I feel like in that sense, he is like, he's brave for what he did. I wouldn't call him. I wouldn't call him like a traitor. I would not call he, him a traitor. But would you? You wouldn't call me a hero either. I don't know about a hero, but I'd call him brave. He download. He also to note. He only released uh, a certain number of documents, but to note. I it's estimated that he extracted like ten I think it was ten million in top secret documents. Like ten million dollars worth or what do no, you mean? Like ten, 10 million, million <laughs> top secret documents. Oh yeah. shit. Like separate documents. That's a lot. Yeah. Well he had like top tier access. See, oh. there there's certain there's certain, certain, there's certain people that have that certain access that have the fucking the balls to kind of be like, yo, this is fucked up. Like we should release this. And I think that's why he is a hero. Yeah. Fuck, saying hero That's sounds what so I'm saying. Weird, it just I sounds I a little call, strange. I, don't call a lot of I mean, heroes. like, like, but no, I mean, he should be uh, because without him, he should be. I, I think, think so. if without him, our eyes of the government would be like, yo, praise the government, but then they're yeah. like bombing shit. That's, that's what I'm saying. Over, and, that, bro, and the government is corrupt. Corrupt. I, would I feel like far, it's, but I think it's corrupt right now for sure. That new COVID bill that just passed. You can't, you can't say something like that, Carrie, and then not back it up with something like the this. The new COVID bill that passed gave the Senate four million. Well, why'd you even bring this topic up, bro? No, I'm saying you yeah, can't yeah, say yeah. something why like that. Ninety-eight percent of the fans bro. that are <laughs> bro, why are you bring up politics now, bro? I subbed oh out God, for Sean. Bro. Let's just note that I <laughs> subbed out for Sean because you guys were talking about like spending politics. time in other countries. And I lived in one, so I was like, oh, maybe I'll yeah, Okay, maybe you know what? Let's, let's get no, back, I'm gonna to back into that. I'm going to sub back into that. Because we have, you're the, I think you're the only one out of all of us that has actually been to, how many countries have you been to, Wyatt? Oh, and Beer Me. Um, and I'm at. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Owen. Truly Owen. me. Owen, Beer Me. <laughs> Owen. How many countries Owen. you say you've been uh, to? Uh, truly US, me as well. Japan, <laughs> South Korea, Surprise Thailand, me. and Australia. South Korea. How do you like South Korea? Oh, South Korea was fucking lit. Yeah? Dude. South Korea is insane. Is it the you, probably the best country you've been to? No, absolutely not. Have you what ever was slept? the best country? What was the best country? Yeah. Um, don't Japan. say Thailand. Please don't say I, Thailand. If I were What's to wrong live, with Thailand? If I were to live in any country... Can you open it, baby? Can you open it, please? <laughs> um, if I could live in any country, it would be Australia, but the best trip I had was... Uh, Japan, by far. I went. I Let's spent, go, baby. I, so. I spent a I week in Kyoto. Really and I just, oh yeah, ooh, dude. I I literally just rented a bike for like a week. And I would listen to little anime music really? right in the streets of Kyoto. Oh, dude, <laughs> I, I was supposed to be there temples. this summer. How old were you? You see any bonsai trees? I was. I was twenty at the time. Would yeah. you, if, if you could go back to the day that you enlisted? Bonsai. Would you back? <laughs> nah, I wouldn't take it back. Really? Yeah. No, it's the best. Bad decision I've ever made. So Did you hold see up, bonsai hold trees. Up. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I saw bonsai trees. Why? Okay, how much Japanese up. do you know, hold bro? On. How much Japanese do I know? Like, do you know more than me? I know arigato. Arigato. That's the fucking opening it, so, of every and then, glory hole. Uh, thank you very much. Is arigato, arigato goes. Arigato. Okay, you think if I went there, I would fit in? 
Fuck I mean, no. Like physically, sure. <laughs> physically, <laughs> he's yeah. too tall for yeah. the Japanese. I guess <laughs> you're too tall, bro. Because I want to. No, I need like, down to move to Japan. Personality-wise, <laughs> I mean, probably not. Uh, dude, I think I could get down in Japan. What do you aren't mean? they really? Nah, aren't they really you quiet? Down Meet in, like, some uh, Korea, Japanese maybe. girls at the South club. South Korea. Mm. Yeah. Hey, I'm fucking hey, fuck out. Okay, you know what? Very small, right? Japan I'm a steer it. I'm a steer it. I'm a steer it. Would you say how? So how long have you been in the military, Wyatt? My bad. Go ahead and chuck that shit and tell me. Oh, I've been in the military uh, a little over three years. Okay. Would you say that you learned more in those three years in the military than you have in your four years at high school? Yeah, absolutely. Like, by far? Not even a question. Absolutely. Really? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, no, I, I did pretty much all my growing up in the military. Really? That's a yeah. trip. And you absolutely. wouldn't take it back? No. it's. I mean, I have such fucking horrible days, but I mean... Like it, it's what made me the person. Yeah, I and, am today, and so. your biceps are as big as my fucking right ass cheek. So Dude, like, seventeen oh, inch like biceps, man. I'm working on. Is it. Is it really seventeen inch? Do you I'm, guys do that shit in the military? I what's the sussest thing? What's bitch. the sussest thing you've seen on a ship, bro? Like, some like I, mad. I, I, I don't think I could tell you on camera. Oh, okay, yeah, we. Okay. Uh, um, uh, hold up, hold up. So we have a request from the audience. They want you to explain your bad days in the military. Just said that, like you just made that up right now. No, 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 no. I, <laughs> I, I got a request from the audience. They, want you, you want, you they want you to explain your bad days well, in the military. I'm on the spot. Uh, my bad days in the military. I think, by far, my worst day in the military. I think was, I was on ship. Uh, we were, you know what? We were just leaving Thailand. We were sitting on ship, and COVID was kind of going on. Or so yeah, it was in the middle of COVID. Um, what was it? It was when the Teddy Roosevelt. Uh, the USS Theodore Roosevelt got COVID. Everyone on that ship got oh, COVID. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it really fucked up all the deployment schedules that were going on at the time. So we got extended for like an extra month, no breaks. And I I, I just didn't know when I was going home. And I I just like being in my own bed, you know, mm. having my own TV, yes, having internet, agreed. and stuff like that. But having internet, it's, fuck. it was just compounded by being fucking I, I worked three months straight 12 hours a day sometimes 16 mm. fuck and you're not your salary your, your salary all the way when you when oh you yeah list. yeah and fucking a and i worked the night shift too so it's like i hardly ever saw sunlight except Oof. for when i was done with my shift and i would go out for my morning cigarette and like oh, i get my five minutes of sun like, you guys get morning blow too right i had him out and then that was it i'd go to bed for 12 hours <laughs> Dude, that's why you could play video games with us huh what do you mean that's why Cause we on the PS4, bro. You'd be like, oh yeah, I'm, Dude, you hop on. It's like 4 a.m. and you're like, yeah, I got work, or I just got off work right now. Oh yeah, yeah. Cause I'm 16 hours ahead of you. Okay, so why you ever think about what you'd be doing if you didn't? Enlist in the military? Oh, dude. So if I wasn't in the military, I was working at PacSun. I was getting like really great hours. I'd probably just be working a dead end job, maybe trying to go to community college mm. without a aim in the world. Yeah, that's where I'd probably be at. Honestly, I tried doing firefighting. I tried doing EMS. <laughs> And I just really wasn't into it. Yeah, I never caught your attention? No. Your mic's off. Why didn't you like it? Uh, you know what? I just wasn't into the whole medical um, field in general, which so that's, like what, that's what 90% of firefighting is in general. Oh, yeah, so for sure. I did I, I did the EMT academy. I'm, I'm a dropout, but I know I do CPR. So like, if you ever need it, <laughs> nice. let me know. But <laughs> they're fucking... Hey, wait. I, if I, I, when I, was if there, I had a heart attack right now, could you, could you like save me? Yeah. Oh, okay. Keep going. Maybe. Anyways, I feel like they were full of fucking, like, uh, 18-year-old Boy Scouts, bro, at the academy. It was, like, the most, like, you just shut the fuck up. Like, like I, I was so annoyed by it. Where'd everyone. you go? Uh, West Coast. Uh, West Coast CMT? Yeah. That's where I went. Yeah. They're dope. The teachers are dope. But fucking yeah. everyone in that class was just fucking, like, cunts. Yeah. Like, they're all just cunts. Yeah, it was either a little cunts but, or it was, like, But, hey, I'm not going to say that when they're saving my life. I'm all like, my homies, hey, West Co What was it called? West Coast EMT. West Coast hey, all my homies, hey, West Coast Yo, EMT. No, 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 West no, no, no. EMT. No, they, if you ever want to become an EMT, I, I highly recommend that course. Absolutely. But uh, you have to understand that you, you need to take shit from people that are fucking losers. They were talking mad shit on me, and I'm like, you're a fucking loser, bro. Like, shut the fuck up. Like, Well, that's how it's going to be anywhere, whether it's the military. Yeah, and, and military, firefighting, job. EMT. Yeah. Dude, I did fire explorers, and these fucking kids, uh, this track star was, like, talking shit on me, and I was like, I will fuck you. I'll beat this. Sh I, I can't take shit from people that I know I'd beat the fuck out of. Like, it just bugs me when people think they have an advantage over me because they know how to tie a knot. I'm kind of scared. Oh, dude. That's how I feel about like, it. What are we even than talking about right now? Tell me I'm so yeah, confused. bro. It's like, shut I got the like fuck. 40 it, pounds it, And you. it's only because of a fucking masculine, like, uh, a male role. Like, you're like, shut oh. the fuck up, bro. Like, oh, I'll, I'll beat your ass. Like, yeah. 
and I couldn't handle that, and it, it just yeah. fucked me up overall. And there was this one chick in my EMT class. She looked like our teacher in sixth grade. She fucking, she'd be like, you, you don't know this yet, Austin? Like, the test is tomorrow. And I'm like, just shut the fuck up. Like, I'll figure it out. Mm-hmm. And she would laugh at me doing a procedure on a fucking dummy doll. Sorry, I just get so heated sometimes. I just yeah, get so heated. You're riled up right now. You bro. are. You yeah. are riled you're up. Fucking, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's because that should be. Because re- you know how much I wanted to be a firefighter. Yeah, you, yeah. Yeah, and then I went to the EMT course fucking twice. I had to pay for that shit twice. Dude, I did the same thing. I yeah. dropped out the first <laughs> time. <laughs> <laughs> I dropped out the first time. I went back the second time. I was yeah. like, fuck this shit, bro. Hey, my brother's are you EMT. Actually my little brother. Yeah. Is Owen not actually not related? We switched parts. <laughs> Did yeah. you have to take that test to like pass and then like you'll become? So a- you MC? take the you take the test after the academy, yeah. in order to take the official national test. Exactly. So when people, I, I see people post on their like Finsta or Instagram, like you get like I, a I certification. I pass the EMT. Right? It's like, bitch, no, you didn't. Go give me take a. The, you have to take the real test. Give me yeah. a. Give me a. Give me a question off the real so test. Bro- give me a question. Oh, dude. Give me you okay. For 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 an infant, how many reps of CPR are you gonna give an infant? How many options? Yeah, what are my a, B, options? C, uh, Give me off the dome. Uh, 15, 15 chest compressions and like three breaths or like 30 chest compressions and two breaths. First one. Yeah, 15, yeah. yeah. I wasn't done yet. Oh. <laughs> I know, but it was definitely the first y'all one. Y'all are both wrong anyways. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> anyways. That's a lie. Oh, yeah, you're going to pull up fact checkers right now, bro? Yeah, pull it up. Yeah, get fact checked. I don't, 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 do don't want to pull it up. I do have to see if Alex is coming, though. How many reps to... Not kill a baby. What was it? How many, How many reps to kill a baby? <laughs> I'll tell you what. With these arms, one. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You know what? Okay. So, low key, bro. We can actually start wrapping up this little podcast. I'm gonna start keeping them a little bit short. You know, yeah, not you know, go crazy. Yeah, um, do any of you guys though want to add anything at all? Like specifically, take it out of the high school to the military to explore, not exploring. Um, seeing the world to surviving high school, maybe anything you guys want to add at all? Yeah, do Boy Scouts. You learn how to tie knots. No, don't do Boy Scouts. Are you? Don't do Boy Scouts. Actually, joke. you know what? That's fucked up. I shouldn't say that. That's. Hey, What's Girl Scouts is dropping a new cookie. Girl Scouts is dropping a new cookie. It's called Toast. It, it it's it, it's flavored like French Yo, what's your toast? favorite? Yo, it's called toast. It's just burnt bread, dude. Yeah, that, it, Shut it, the it, fuck up, Wyatt. <laughs> what's your favorite Girl Scout cookie? Uh, right now. All times gotta be thin mints, bro. I fuck with thin s'mores. Mints. Yeah, I fuck with s'mores, but it's gotta be thin mints. You know, I think, uh, dude, those when they came out with s'mores, that shit smacked. S'mores, but s'mores, s'mores. s'mores. Like they s'mores? came out with s'mores. Oh, There's the s'mores are kind of fire. That shit bro. Smacked. I like the lemon, lemon. Lemon guys, cookies hit. Yeah. What are you guys talking about? Girl Scout cookies. What's your um, favorite Girl Scout cookies? Oh, dude, you what gotta you? get the. The van- or wait, which one? The peanut butter ones. Oh, okay, I'm allergic to fucking peanuts, Gary. Bro, the peanut butter ones so are. Yeah, you, put it, you put them in the freezer tier. though. You put I'm them in the freezer. Woo! I'm allergic. I'm allergic hey, to nuts. Thin mints are the Ooh. worst fucking Girl okay, Scout cookies. Relax, Fuck relax. thin mints. If oh. you guys like thin mints, fuck you guys. Hey, wait. Add a quick question. Any oh, my hey. homies hate thin mints. Look at me in the eye and say that shit. <laughs> fuck you. He's over the thin mints. That's right. He wants to fuck you. No, 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 not on my equipment, not on my equipment, not on my equipment. God. because the equipment was here. Hey, did yeah. any of you guys get the COVID vaccine? Nope. I did. No. Yo, my homie My sister it. got it. My I homie did not. I haven't heard from him in like two weeks. Yeah, I did. You know Jalen? You know Jalen? I got Jaylen it. I'm left handed now. I think Jalen's gone. Like, he hasn't said nothing. <laughs> nah, bro. My, my sister, my sister he got, got it. microchip, dude. <laughs> yeah, your my sister, sister did get my it. My sister got it. Because she's a. Uh, she's, uh, she's probably uh, she off the perk uh, right now. Huh? What do you call it? A healthcare? She's a healthcare provider? Healthcare worker? Physical therapist? Yes. Yeah, so what do you call them? Healthcare providers or essential worker? Your yeah, sister is a fake physical therapist. Yeah, I know. You ask her if you if you hurt yourself, she's going to say just put ice on it, bro. She's like a school nurse. Um. Yeah, that's how doctors are in the fucking Marine Corps. They're like, hey, yeah, just change your socks, drink some water, drink some, or eat some fucking mochi. Change your dude. socks. <laughs> yeah, no, one hundred percent. That's Wait, what they do. You're like your trying socks. to get out it's of it. It's usually because your walks or because usually because your socks are wet, so just change them real quick. That's one hundred percent how it fucking what? works. Really? Yes. Wow, I didn't know that. Um, other than that Bullshit. though, you you got anything else you want to add at all? Oh, anything I else do. you guys want to add? Um, I tweeted this before, bro. I wanted to. Okay, like realistically, if I bought a hundred Chick Fil A sandwiches on a Saturday night, went there the next day on Sunday and was selling them for like a dollar extra. Oh how many do you think I can sell? Bro, 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 bro. Hold up. No how one? many do you think I can no, sell? No, no, no. Honestly. I don't, uh, wait, how many? Like, like okay. Not 100, but like, let's say I bought like 10. Just say just say 10. Just say uh, 10. I would Pull. say like two. I think two. Honestly, wait, wait. You're I, saying that he'd sell only two? Yes, because, dude, it's a day old. They're going to be cold as fuck. Cap. No. Nah, I, 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 how are you going to heat it up? Huh? Okay. Tell me. Tell me. Tell me. No, no, no. no. I will, I will, I'm going to tell you right here, right now, okay? Okay, check this out. I'm not going to lie, dude. How many times have you got caught lacking on a Sunday going to Chick fil A? I've got caught a five few times. times. Oh, okay. yeah, recently, I have not, but not recently, but, but back then, like about two years ago, I probably went 
like ten times. You know, I'm, George's I'm isn't even open on Sunday too. Okay, I'd be like, but but listen, up, but listen, bro. Up. I can just get like a little little heater or whatever because they're in the the tin. You have things, a right? fucking point. And that's on what that. I'm saying, bro. Okay, and we sell them for bro. I would even like upcharge like three bucks, bro. Okay, but say yeah, like on Sundays. Say, say like no one comes because they know it's closed on Sunday. Dude, bro. no, I'm trying to but tell you right now. Will people go. will go. I go. I go. That's I what go. I'm saying. I, we're we're so all talking about how many times I, we I fucked see, up going Chick Fil A. I see my reward I'm points. I'm taking the risk, work. bro. Yeah, I see my reward <laughs> points at work. I'm like, fuck yeah, I'm gonna get a free sandwich. So, and it doesn't even cross I'm your mind. No one's gonna buy. All right, hey, okay. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it tonight or tomorrow. Tomorrow? Let's fucking do it. I'll sit out there with you. Tomorrow, Saturday. I'll make a TikTok. Hey, okay. Yo, tell you what. Wait, where are you selling them at? I'll look at, literally, he's gonna I will sell at Chick Fil A. You buy them at Chick Fil A. He's gonna sell at Chick Fil A. You buy them. I know. You're the, you're the military, know. bro. You're fucking. You're so what? what? So what? What are you doing? What? Okay, why? He's, like, if, if he's at Nordstrom. He's at Nordstrom. If I gave you a fucking you work with Garrett ca- Dow. If I gave you a math calculation, you'd be screwed. Luke has a black toe. Okay, no, I don't. It's gone. I went to Doctor Hall. Why we gotta bring race into this? Yeah. Doctor Pimple. Listen. You Dr. buy, Pimple you buy ten, savage. you buy, you buy ten Chick Fil A sandwiches, hey. and you flip all of them, and you sell five. Oh, dude! No, 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 no! I'm listen. with that. Listen, listen, listen! Don't upcharge. Hey. No, 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 no! How uh, are you gonna make money? Listen, don't upcharge. Listen, no, you sell, you just see if you can do it. You sell five for the people, <laughs> guys. Yeah, for the people. You sell five. What, I'll double your p- what you whatever you got paid. Bet, okay. Bet. Oh. What? That makes no sense. Wait, wait. Hey. So if he drops, if he drops thirty for ten sandwiches. And he only sells five of those sandwiches. You're no, saying that whatever what? he makes, I'll double it. If gotcha. it's over five, hey, though, gotcha, if gotcha, it's over gotcha. five, hey, five over. your best bet then selling. is to buy it all on Saturday night. Go to church next Sunday Hold morning. Up. Okay, that's, sell, a, that's a business right there. Sell fucking Chick Fil A on Sunday at church. Luke was one of the guys buying that's smart. all the Popeyes chicken sandwiches when they first came out and selling them on Grailed for like. Six bands. Who? And how do you Ooh. think we bought no all way. this equipment, yes, motherfucker? Yes, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Hey, shout out Popeyes, bro. You got a dude. You a whole different type of like entrepreneur to think hey, about that, bro. Crazy. That's some. I'm in my bag. That's some like outside the box. Type. I have some other you ideas. You might have some mental it. issues. You think a bunch of old white people are gonna be like, hey? This little youngster selling Chick Fil A outside no. of church seems like bro, a bro. They're gonna deal. be like, who don't the fuck is that? Nah, he he don't sell it out of church. Like don't sell it at Owen. No, we're applauding Owen, no, we're applauding Owen because Owen said something. That, I don't know. I don't. I don't That's remember. That's what he, he said. That's literally what he said. It's You're like, oh no, no, I would never sell it. Listen, okay, okay. What about what about is that a Van Dyke jersey? Sell it at church. Sell it at church. Saturday Whenever night, he buy says, it, I'm about church the next morning. Oh, oh in fact, that's what I'm saying. I don't think old white people are gonna want to buy fucking Chick Fil A from Wait, the little. Wait, you're not selling no. If you look fuck the church idea. If, fuck the church idea. If Luke fuck buys Chick Fil A sandwiches on a Saturday tonight, and he goes to Chick Fil A tomorrow, midday maybe. Today's Friday, but Today's yeah. Friday. I mean, okay. Today's Friday. Tomorrow he buys Chick Fil A sandwiches. On Sunday he's selling them at Chick Fil A. I guarantee you, there's gonna be because, because dude, you don't know how many times I pulled up to Chick Fil A on a Sunday and they weren't open, and I've been so like mad. I've been so mad sometimes. I think like three. It's, it's I've been like five times. It's of the mad. Girl Scout selling Girl Scout cookies outside of the dispensary. All right, that's the type of level I'm trying Boom. to get on. Oh my god. Okay. Wait, Yo, I would so never, I would I never send wait. my ten-year-old daughter what? outside I'd of like a school. What? Great analogy. Selling wait, 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 wait. Hold on. I want to call you Luke bro. first. Go ahead. Luke, go ahead. Because if you get caught doing that, you'll get fined. Like for real. Wait, 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 wait. For real. What? Because what? you're selling, selling chi- chicken. Yes. <laughs> you're not adhering to health standards. Wait, oh. what? Is that a thing? On the bag, on the bag, it says not resell. I get my own bag. A kid's gonna get fucking fined for selling. Put it in the bag. Hey, wait, 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 wait! That's out of a goddamn Chick Fil A on a Sunday. Fuck you, Luke. Hey, wait. Imagine this. Imagine this. Someone gets sick. Someone gets sick. Someone finds you. Oh shit. Boom. Well, for what? Boom. For they what? sell Chick Fil A because that's Chick Fil A shit. Give me the citation. He gets sick, bro. But no, I would, I would, fuck I would, if you. If I got in the house, how would you if sue I got, me? How would you sue? Where would you find me? Yeah, I'm, if I'm, I got sued, oh. I would not sue Luke. I would sue Chick Fil A. I'm on the block. No. Why would you sue the company? What are you, what are you gonna do? I'm not gonna oh, sue oh, him. Oh, you know what they were saying? Oh, you bought chicken from a random guy outside of our store on Sunday when it's obviously closed. But but you, but hold up, wait, 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 wait. You you are the type of people that bring me down. I'm trying to make money, bro. Right. Let oh, me dude. say something, bro. Let him pay his oh, it's, it's Chick Fil A. So if they like, for some reason, if one of their chickens is bad, then they did it for a reason. Whenever no. Chick Fil A gives me the wrong drink, I say, you know what? I'm just saying they did it for a reason, I and it's I won't for buy some it. reason it's better. I won't buy it. 
because it's just it, it, it won't taste good to me. Right, it won't fucking taste good. Yeah, you know what? We it all, won't taste good. How are you keeping it warm? No, how are you keeping the chicken warm? Everybody will not taste good to me. How are you keeping it's gonna the chicken taste warm? dry, and old, and disgusting. I it? Dry. Why? It's just dry. Oh, dry. Dry. Thank you for tuning Gross. in. <laughs> I, uh, I like the Giorno pizzas. <laughs> All right, anyways. Hey. The hey. Anyway, anyways, the ladies and gentlemen, thank you for tuning but in to this hut. segment of Suburb Talks. Pizza I'm your host, Nick Rajeta. Uh, everyone else, uh, I'm Kyle Kirkland. Later. <laughs> um, Fuck. Later, um, later um, Kerry um, Martin. I'm Sean uh, Strapp. Peace out. Owen Miller. Love you guys. I'll see you guys next week. Take care and remember to get an STD check. God, what the fuck was that, yo?